Hello and welcome here on barfußlaufen.tv. My name is Thorsten Ludwig. I'm the owner and founder of Soul Runner Barefoot Shoes. And today I would like to introduce you our new, well, it's not so new, we have it in several years, but uh, this is a new color version. It's a new version. We have it in this color, in blue and orange. And we have it in blue and blue with a blue outsole. I would like to introduce you and give you some product information to this Soul Runner Ares kit shoe for winter. Stay tuned. So as always we start from the bottom and here you could see the outsole. It's the outsole which we use on almost all of our shoes. It's a very sticky outsole. It's a 4 plus 2 millimeter outsole. Means we have a 4 millimeter outsole and 2 millimeter of profile. So in total we have a 6 millimeter outsole which gives, gives a good protection from the ground and uh, always also a good isolation from the ground especially for this shoe it's a kid shoe for winter so in the winter when the surface is cold this six millimeter outsole gives also a nice isolation apropos isolation we have also an insole for this shoe so this gives an extra isolation this insole is in every sporty shoe this is a plain leather upper material which has several advantages. Number one, it's pretty easy to care, pretty easy to polish. Please use a polish in the appropriate color and of course use an impregnation spray. But later on I will say something about how to care this shoe. The inner lining is a fleece lining. We use this lining on several shoes. We have really a lot of shoes using this lining and this lining is very good. It's, the abrasion is very good from the shoe. Plus it takes off the moisture and it gives back the moisture. And this is more important for kid shoes because kids have the same amount of pores on the on the foot sole than adults but and the shape of the foot is smaller than the shape of um, of an adult so this is the reason why almost every kid has wet socks when wearing the shoes because of the pores the closure is a velcro closure it has two velcro stripes these are pretty easy pretty open and pretty pretty easy to open and pretty easy to close even for kids fingers and also for cold kit fingers this is a winter shoe so please consider this and uh, it's pretty easy for the kids to close the shoes open the shoes so no help from adults are necessary especially in the kindergarten i think this is a quite good uh, a quite good thing that kids can open and close the shoes by themselves the width of this shoe is white we always we all ways use the same width in all of our shoes of course as i said it's um it's a winter lining so it might take off a little bit space or it will take off a little of a little bit of the space a little bit of the room inside the shoe so please consider 12 13 millimeters to the length of the kit foot okay then let's go to the water resistant test and as always i take uh, this injection here and I put some drops on the on the upper material as you can see the drops does not suck into the material they stay into the material so this shoe is not waterproof it's water resistant but we always recommend our spray our impregnation spray so please use this spray from time to time to uh, impregnate this uh, upper material and also as I said also, as I said in the beginning, use some polish, some polish in appropriate blue, maybe in a dark blue, especially when the kids are kneeing and they scratch the upper material here. It doesn't look nice after a while. So please use this polish and use this material or any other spray which are related, which are good for, for this leather, for suede leather, for nubuk leather. This is good for also for textile. Also for membranes, if you're using textile with membranes like Gore-Tex or Simpertex, this does not harm the, the breathability. So please use or any use this or any other of this impregnation spray to maintain the water resistance of the shoe. That's for now. Thank you for tuning in. If you like this video, if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and 
subscribe to the channel and if you activate the bell then you will be uh, informed by YouTube when we load up a new video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, any comments, please write down in the comment field and bye bye. See you later.